Hi, this is Mrs. Freifeld, and I'm going to help teach you how to divide by a single digit in the divisor, and I'm going to use three this time. There are four steps to dividing. There's division, multiplication, subtraction, and then bringing down. And I use Does McDonald's Sell Burgers to help to remind me of what those steps are. When you do the first step of division, you're going you're gonna to sing the song. In this case, it's going to be the three song, which is going to be in the divisor. And the number of fingers it takes you to get to the number of the dividend, that's what you're going to write at the top of the problem. For the next step, which is multiplication, you're going to sing the same song of the divisor, in this case of three, but whatever you sing is what you write on, at the bottom. The third step is to subtract those two numbers, and the fourth step is to bring down the next number. This is my first example. Now I'm assuming that you already know the threes times tables, that you've already learned the song. So I'm going to make these multiples disappear so that you don't look at them. Okay, when I start out with a problem, I always cover up everything but the number I need to look at. And in this case, it's one digit in the dividend, and then the three in the divisor. And with division, the first step is I'm going to sing this song, and when I go over the five, I'm going to stop and take the last finger away. Three, six, well six goes over five, so I stop, I take the last finger away, and the number of fingers is what I'm going to write at the top, and I'm going to put a one right above that five. That's my division step. My next step is to multiply. When I multiply, it's when I sing the song of the divisor for however many fingers I wrote at the top. And whatever I sing, that's what I'm going to write underneath the 5. 3. That's what I write under the 5. And my next step is to subtract. 5 take away 3 is 2. After I subtract, my last step is to bring down the next number. So down goes the 9. When you bring down a number, you have to go back up to the division and go through the steps again. So I'm going to sing the 3 song until I go over 29, and then I'm going to stop and take the last finger away. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21. 24, 27. I never went over 29. So the number of fingers is what I write at the top. Now for my multiplication, I'm going to sing the three song for the nine fingers that I wrote at the top. And whatever I sing, that's what I write underneath the 29. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21. 24, 27, I'm going to write 27 underneath the 29. And after I multiply, I'm going to subtract. 29 minus 27 is 2. My next step is to bring down. I don't have any more numbers to bring down, so whatever is down here, that's my remainder. And the answer to this problem is 19 with a remainder of 2. Let's try it again. Again, you should know your threes times tables. You should know the songs now. So I'm going to make those disappear. And the next step is I always cover up everything with the number I'm working with. So I don't get confused. My first step is division. That means I sing the song that's in the divisor until I reach the number that's in the dividend or go over it. If I go over it, I stop and I take the last finger away. Three, six, nine. I didn't go over it. I hit it exactly. So how many fingers did it take? It took three. I put a three right above the nine. My next step is multiplication. When I multiply, I sing the song of the divisor for the number of fingers I wrote at the top. And whatever I sing, that's what I write down here. 3, 6, 9. Well, I sang 9, so I put a 9 under here. My next step over here is to subtract. 
9 minus 9 is 0. My next step is to bring down. I need to take this away because I need that number now. And down it comes. Okay, as soon as I bring a number down, I'm back up to the division part. I sing the 3 song until I go over 6. And if I go over 6, I stop and take the last finger away. If not, it's just the number of fingers it took me to get to 6. 3, 6. I landed on it exactly, and it took me 2 fingers to get there. I put a 2 above the 6. My next step is to multiply. And that means I sing this song for this many fingers, and whatever I sing is what I write at the bottom. 3, 6. I sang a 6, so that's what I write under there. My next step is to subtract. 6 minus 6 is 0. After I subtract, I bring down. But there's not a number to bring down, so 0 is my remainder. But since 0 is the remainder, we don't usually put remainder 0. We just leave it alone. The answer to this problem is 32. Let's try it again. Cover up every number you're not using. Use your finger or the end of a pencil or an eraser. Just don't look at it. My division says I'm going to sing the song of the divisor until I got over the number in the dividend. Then I'm going to stop and take the last finger away. 3, 6, 9. Well, 9 is bigger than 7. I stop and I take the last finger away, and the number of fingers, which is 2, is what I write at the top. After dividing, the next step is multiplying. That's where I sing the song of the divisor for the number of fingers I wrote at the top, and whatever I sing, that's what I write underneath the 7. 3, 6. I sang a 6. My next step after multiplying is subtraction. 7 minus 6 is 1. Now I'm going to bring the next number down. So I need to uncover it, because I need it now. And down it comes. As soon as I bring a number down, I'm back up to the division part. And that's where I sing the 3 song until I go over 18. And then I stop and take the last finger away. In this case, I'm actually going to land on 18, so I'm just going to use that number. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18. I landed on it exactly, and the number of fingers is 6. My next step is multiplication. That's where I sing the song of the divisor for the number of fingers that I wrote at the top, and whatever I sing, that's what I write down. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18. And I sang 18. So that's what I'm going to write down here. After I multiply, my next step is subtraction. 18 minus 18 is 0. And then my next step is bring the next number down. There isn't another number to bring down. And so this would be my remainder. But we do not write 26 with the remainder of 0. If the remainder is 0, you just leave it alone. The answer is 26. <clears throat> okay, now I'm going to have three digits in the dividend. Again, I'm going to cover everything but the one I need up. So it looks less confusing. The first step is division. That's where I sing the song of the divisor until I reach the number in the dividend. In that case, it's the number of fingers. If I go over the number in the dividend, I stop and take the last finger away. 3. I landed on it exactly, and it took me one finger to get to 3. After division, my next step is multiplication. That's where I sing the song of the divisor for the number of fingers at the top, and whatever I sing, that's what I write at the bottom. 3. Well, that was easy enough. So I write the 3 right there. After multiplication, there's subtraction. 3 minus 3 is 0. And now my next step is to bring the next number down. Well, I'm not going to take the blue thing away. I'm just going to move it to the side. I only want to look at the next number. That's the only one I need. And I'm going to bring the next one down. 
Okay, once it's been brought down, I have to go back up to the division part. That's where I sing the song of the divisor until I reach the number that's in the dividend. If I go over, I stop and I take the last finger away. Three, six, nine. Nine is bigger than seven. So I stop, I take the last finger away. And the number of fingers, which is two, is what I write at the top. After I divide, I multiply. I'm going to sing the three song for two fingers, and whatever I sing, that's what I'm going to write down underneath the seven. Three, six. I sang a six, so I put it underneath the seven. After I multiply, my next step is to subtract. And seven minus six, it's one. After I subtract, I need to bring down another number. In this case, I have another number. So I uncover it, and I bring it down. If I bring another number down, I have to go through the steps again. So now I'm at division again. That's where I sing the three song. If I go over 11, I stop, and I take the last finger away. Three, six, nine, twelve. 12 goes over, so I stop, I take the last finger away, the number of fingers, that's what I write at the top. My next step is multiplication. That's where I sing the three song for the number of fingers I wrote at the top, and whatever I sing, that's what I write down here. Three, six, nine, I sang a nine. So that's what goes under the 11. My next step, is to subtract. 11 minus 9 is 2. My next step is to bring down the next number. There are no numbers to bring down. So this number down here, it's my remainder. So I put R and 2. Let's try another one. Again, there's three digits in your dividend. I'm going to cover them up. My first step is division. I'm going to sing my three song until I get to nine. If I go over, I stop and take the last finger away. Three, six, nine. I hit it exactly. And how many fingers did it take? Three fingers. And that's the number I write on top. My next step is multiplication. That's where I sing the song of the divisor or the number of fingers at the top, and whatever I sing, that's what I write underneath the nine. Three, six, nine, and I sang a nine. And there it goes. After the multiplication is subtraction. Nine minus nine is zero. Then comes bringing down. I'm just gonna move it over. I don't wanna look at all the numbers, I just want to look at that 5. I need to bring that 5 down. Once I bring a number down, I've got to go to the division part again. That's where I sing the 3 song. If I go over the number 5, I stop and I take the last finger away. 3, 6. 6 goes over 5. I stop. I take the last finger away. The number of fingers is what I write at the top. And here's my multiplication part. I sing the song of the divisor for the number of fingers I wrote at the top. And whatever I sing, that's what I write down here. Three. I sang a three. After the multiplication is subtraction. Five minus three is two. And my next step is to bring the next number down. There's another number, there it is. I can take away the blue cover, and down it comes. As soon as I bring a number down, I have to go through the division again. That's where I sing the song of the divisor until I got over this number, and then I stop, and I take the last finger away. Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, eighteen, twenty-one. Twenty-one went over twenty. So I stop, I take the last finger away. How many fingers do I have? I have six. That's the number I write at the top. 
after division is multiplication. I sing the three song for six fingers, and whatever I sing, that's the number I write under 20. Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, eighteen. I sang an eighteen. And that's the number I write under twenty. My next step is to subtract. Twenty minus eighteen is two. And then my next step is to bring down. There isn't anything to bring down. So this two, that's my remainder. So I put remainder two. This is going to be my last example with threes. Cover everything but the number you're working with. I'm going to sing the three song until I go over six. Three, six. But I don't have to because I hit it exactly. And it took me two fingers to do that. So I write it at the top. After I divide, I multiply. I sing the song of the divisor for this many fingers. And whatever I sing, I write at the bottom. Three, six. After I multiply, I subtract. Six minus six is zero. After I subtract, I need to bring the next number down. I'm going to bring down that two. I don't really need to sing because three is bigger than two. So I can't get any groups of three out of two. So I'm going to write a zero at the top. And now I'm going to multiply. Three times zero is zero. And after I multiply, I subtract. Two minus zero, it's two. And my next step is to bring the next number down. And I see a nine. Now I'm going to do my division part. I'm going to sing the three song till I go over 29, and I'm going to stop and take the last finger away. Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, eighteen, twenty-one, twenty-four, twenty-seven. I never went over 29, and it took me nine fingers to get there. And now I'm going to multiply. I'm going to sing the three song for this many fingers, and whatever I sing, that's what I write down underneath the 29. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 27. I'm going to write 27 underneath the 29. And after I multiply, I subtract. 29 minus 27 is 2. After subtracting, I need to bring the next number down. There's only one, so I'll take the cover away. And down it comes. And now I'm going to sing the three song until I go over the number 21. And then I'll stop and take the last finger away. In this case, I'm going to hit the 21 exactly. Watch. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 21. So I never went over it. I hit it exactly. It took me seven fingers to do it. Now I'm going to multiply. I'm going to sing the three song for seven fingers. Whatever I sing is what I'm going to write at the bottom. Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen, eighteen, twenty-one. There's the two. And here's the one. After I multiply, I subtract. 21 minus 21, it's 0. There's nothing else to bring down. And since my remainder is 0, I don't have to write an R0 at the end. It's just 2,097. And that's all, folks, for the threes. I hope I helped. This is Miss Freifeld. Goodbye.